have Jen from Luxury Daily. Jen, do you think we'll see more interactivity in social videos? I think so. I think that the, um, that we, what we saw in the second quarter of 2014 really kind of showed that brands are moving towards incorporating certain touch points that the consumer feels more involved with the film rather than just a viewer. Um, Armani had a video for Aqua de Geo that allowed the consumer to click an icon and it would change the um, perspective of the video. And even though the consumer wasn't exactly involved, there's still that kind of interaction. They're allowed to kind of be part of it and make um, their own interpretations from the different perspectives. And also there was the Dior Wonderland campaign, which was a really important move uh, by incorporating mobile into the video, by you know hooking up your mobile device, you could access additional content, which was also video driven. So I think um, as the next quarter comes along, we'll see a lot more of this.